Marina Isgro, the Nam Jun Paik Research Fellow at the Harvard Art Museums. My position is actually a new one that was created this year, and it is part of a gift from Ken Hakuda, who is the head of the Nam Jun Paik estate and also the nephew of the artist. He gave the museums a gift of nine works by Paik that ranged his career from 1965 until 2005, and he also gave us a financial gift to create um, a fellowship meant to encourage academic study of Paik. I think most people know Paik as the father of video art, but actually what we want to highlight in the show is how much he crossed between different media. He was trained in music, and his first works were live performances, one of his most famous pieces from that period is called One for Violin Solo. He would raise a violin very, very slowly over his head, and then he would suddenly smash it. Later in his life, he also worked a lot with drawing and painting, which is something people don't really know. So we're hoping to provide a sense of the real scope of his career and the way he kind of broke down the rules that separated different artistic mediums.